the chair recognizes, recognizes Minority Full Leader Singh. Thank you very much, Mr. Speaker. I want to uh, just first start off by uh, talking about this process that has led us to this uh, amendment as well as the substitution. Uh, the majority, again, has every opportunity to share with us what you are doing. And what you have done here is you put in a substitute that is, of course, of many, many pages that we have not had the opportunity to take a look at. We actually had amendments ready, but because of the way you put your substitute in, we can't actually add amendments to this and have an actual dialogue and debate. You are making changes here. You are making changes to the way disclaimers are done. You're making changes to the way we deal with in-kind dollars and resources. These are important issues to the public. And not allowing the minority the opportunity to actually read and understand those amendments without just saying this is what we are planning on doing is not the way the process that we have done. If we had amendments to this bill, we have not been given the opportunity to actually present those amendments to the majority. And again, if we were talking about process, again, process is important. And so I'm asking my members at this point in time to oppose this bill because we don't actually know all the details of the bill because you've not given the opportunity for us to actually understand what's in this bill. And you have the opportunity as the majority to provide us the time to do that. And I think it's a shame because this could have been a bipartisan bill uh, as it was starting off in the process and us not knowing what's actually in it does not allow us to be able to move forward at this point in time. Thank you very much, Mr. Speaker. Thank you, Minority Full Leader Singh. The clerk will tally, display, and announce a vote. Speaker, on the question of final passage of Senate Bill 571, there are 58 high votes and 48 nay votes. A majority of the members elected and serving having voted therefore, the bill is passed.